Praise the Lord, everyone, and welcome to Shawnee's Prayer. And as always, I start my prayer off with a blood scripture, coming from Romans chapter 5, verse 9. Much more than being now justified by his blood, we shall be saved from wrath through him. Let's go to the throne of grace. Father God, in the name of Jesus, Lord God, I just want to say thank you, Father God. Thank you, Father God, for another day. Thank you for another day that we get to receive more of your love, more of your goodness, more of your grace, more of your mercy, more of your compassion. Thank you for another day that we get to draw closer to you, O oh God. In the name of Jesus, Father God, thank you for another day we get to um, repent and we get to get it right with you, Father God. Thank you for another day that we get to spend with our family and our friends and our loved ones, Father God. God. Thank you for another day, Father God, that we get to tell someone we love them, Father God. Thank you for another day that we get to experience love, oh God. In the name of Jesus, Father God. Lord God, I come and ask you, Father God, in the name of Jesus, to watch over each and every person on today, oh God, in the name of Jesus, Father God. Regardless of where we're at in the world, Father God, you see us all, Father God, and you see exactly what we are going through, Father God. You see what we are dealing with, Father God. God, in the name of Jesus, Father God, you know our every need, Father God, in the name of Jesus, you know our every want, Father God, in the name of Jesus, and you're the same God that can provide for me and can provide for everyone else. All at the same exact time, Father God. For you are right here now and you are already in the future, Father God. You are right here with me, Father God. And you're in Africa, Father God. You're in the continent of Asia, Father God. You're in Australia, Father God. You're in the European, Father God. You're everywhere, Father God. All at the same exact time, Father God. And you don't get overwhelmed by seeing all of us, Father God. You don't get overwhelmed, Father God, by hearing all of our prayers, Father God. I just want to thank you, Father God. I want to say thank you, Father God, for the many times you hear our prayers, Father God. Thank you for the many times that you have stepped in right at in the nick of time, oh God. Just when we was about to lose hope, Father God. Just when we was about to give up on ourselves, Father God. You stepped in in the nick of time. So I want to say thank you, Father God, for every nick of time, Father God. Every time that you stepped in. Every time that you made a way. Every time that you opened a door, Father God. Every time that you healed us, Father God. In the name of Jesus, Father God. Every time that you just was there for us, Father God. That you was able to hear our tears, see our tears, and hear our cries. All the times that we can even pray to you, Father God. There were times that we couldn't pray. All we could do was moan and groan. But I thank you for knowing the moans. I thank you for understanding the groans, Father God. In the name of Jesus, Father God, I just come and ask you, Father God, to watch oh, watch out over everyone, oh God, in the name of Jesus. Lord God, watch over everyone on this Friday. Look down upon those who are already on Saturday, Father God, in the name of Jesus, Father God. I pray that you will cover every person in this world in the blood of Jesus, oh God. Lord God, I pray, Father God, that you will save those, Father God, who don't know you in a pardon of their sins. I pray that they would get to know who you are, Father God. I pray they will begin to walk with you on today, Father God. In the name of Jesus, Lord God. I pray that someone will repent and accept you as their Lord and Savior, Lord God. In the name of Jesus, Father God. Lord God, I pray, Father God, in the name of Jesus, oh God, that you will lift us up in the spirit, oh God. I pray that you will watch over everyone as we are experiencing our heat wave, oh God. I pray that no one have a heat stroke, Father God. I pray that you will cover every home in the blood, cover every vehicle in the blood, every office in the blood, Lord God. In the name of Jesus, don't allow anyone to have a stroke or a heart attack, Father God. Look down upon those who have to work in this heat. Look down upon every lifeguard, Father God. Look down upon everyone who will be at the beach or in the pool or at a lake, Father God. Cover them in the blood. Allow 
allow no one to drown, allow no one to have a shark attack, oh God, in the name of Jesus, Father God, Lord God, I pray that you will cover them in the precious blood of Jesus Christ, oh God, in the name of Jesus, Father God, I pray for those who will go to happy hour on today after work, I pray for those who will drink and drive, I pray for those who will drive under the influence of drugs, Father God, I pray, Father God, that someone will step in and take their keys away, Father God, in the name of Jesus, Father God, I pray for mercy and grace, Father God, I pray that you will look down upon every driver, look down upon every passenger, Father God, in the name of Jesus, Father God, Lord God, look down upon those who will drive erratic, oh God, look down upon those who will go through red lights and stop signs and yield signs, Father God, in the name of Jesus, Father God, Lord God, I just pray and ask you, Father God, that you will allow everyone to make it home safely, Father God, allow everyone to make it home, Father God. God, without any hurt, harm, or danger, Father God, look down upon those, Father God, that live in the country, oh God, allow no one to hit a deer, Father God, in the name of Jesus, allow no one to hit a horse or a bear, Father God, or a coyote, Father God, regardless of where they live at, Father God, look down upon those who intentionally hit animals, Father God, like possums and raccoons, Father God, look down upon that person, mental state, Father God, look down upon those who want to cause harm to other people, Father God. Look down upon those who are harming children, Father God. In the name of Jesus, Father God, I pray that you will deliver that person, Father God. I pray that you will reveal that situation and expose that situation, Father God. In the name of Jesus, I pray for everyone who's dealing with some form of trauma, oh God. In the name of Jesus, Father God, I pray for those who are dealing with unforgiveness, Father God. In the name of Jesus. I pray for those who are in a spiritual warfare, oh God, in the name of Jesus, Father God. I pray for those that don't understand what they're going through, Father God. I pray for those that don't understand why they're going through, Father God, in the name of Jesus, Father God. I just pray for each and every last one of us, Father God, that you help us to have a mind of Christ in the name of Jesus, Father God. Help us to have a heart of Christ, oh God, in the name of Jesus, Father God. Help us to walk up right before you, oh God, in the name of Jesus, Father God. I just pray, Lord God, in the name of Jesus, Lord God, that you will take us higher in you, Father God. God, in the name of Jesus, Lord God. Take us deeper in you, Father God, in the name of Jesus, Father God. Allow us to remember, regardless of what we go through, Father God, you are the source of our strength, Father God, and the strength of our lives, Lord God. And I thank you on today, God. I thank you, Lord God. I thank you, Father God. I thank you, Father God. I thank you for being our strength, oh God. In the name of Jesus, thank you for being our way maker, Father God. Thank you for being our confidant, Father God. Thank you for being the one that we can trust, Father God. The one that we can put our hope in, Father God. We thank you, Lord God. We thank you for being God, Lord God. We thank you, Father God. We thank you, Jesus. We don't take it for granted, Lord God, that we get to come to you, Lord God. We don't take it for granted that we can come boldly to that throne of grace, Father God. We don't take it for granted, Lord God, but we thank you and we praise you and we honor you, Father God. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, I pray you. Amen. Amen and amen. God bless you. God bless you. Thank you for joining Shawnee's prayer. And as always, if there's something you need me to pray for, you can always DM me at Inspirations by God. God bless you. Have a blessed and safe weekend.